Valley of the Dales is not responsible for lost or stolen articles. Oh, I gotta focus on my task here. Acknowledge every LGN game, and then I can move on. Well, let's get to the wrestling games next. Now, there were three on NES brandishing the LJN logo, and thankfully, I've already talked about them. Trying to hit a guy here is like trying to hit a grain of sand with a tennis racket while Andre the Giant farts directly into your nostrils. Steel cage challenge, well, it has a steel cage mode. If you like glimpsing the wrestlers through the cage, get the cage out of the way, I can't see anything. Just kick him to the ground and repeatedly stomp his dick, then pin him for the slowest three count in history. One funny thing I forgot to mention was that in both WrestleMania Challenge and King of the Ring, you can play as yourself. What the hell is that supposed to mean? It's not like you can customize it to actually look like yourself. King of the Ring also had a Game Boy version. It's similar to the NES version, but even more awkward and with Atari sounds. WWF, more like WTF. WWF Superstars was a big improvement. Better graphics, has music during the match, but whenever the characters get close, their bodies sort of fuse together. It's weird. Then there's WWF Superstars 2. Hey, it's on the title screen and they're already wrestling. It's impressive they included the wrestlers theme songs. You have the option to fight in a cage match, which I don't really see the point of. But hey, each Game Boy version is an improvement over the last. Next up, we have a trilogy on Super Nintendo. In my wrestling episode, I trashed all three of these games, but I have to admit, these were fun. The first was WWF Super WrestleMania. It had a great character lineup, and seeing the faces all digitized was new and exciting. It gave you the option of fighting one-on-one -on -one or tag team, and you had a variety of moves to pull off. You could jump off the ropes and even fight outside the ring. It introduced a grapple system where you gotta tap the button real fast to perform a move. So if you're playing with a friend, it's all about who has the fastest thumbs. And that's when it gets crazy. You gotta fucking tap that shit like grease lightning. And if you're both the same...